Uh, having worked in the UK, yeah. of course I was involved with AAP, American Law. Exactly. That's one reason they said goodbye, sir. Right. Right. But New Jersey has uh, They have teachers. They have teachers. What do you do that? Hey Tony, smile. So when, when you served that, that uh, those several uh, stores there, you almost might have started out Yeah, we never went to the side of the They used to have the movies where they give you a ticket and they had a horse race and then if your horse won, they give you a prize up on the stage. And put it in the thing. He said, I, he said, I just got literally died of my death. Because this guy sent him, it must have cost him a little bit of that. And it's it for the room for the bread itself. But that's what it was. And that's what it was. I remember one time I was out in Phoenix, Arizona, and I see a sign, a big sign in the window, paper sign.
everyone, and thank you for getting coming out here. Right? Come on, come on, come on. We're still working at it. We're still working at it. All right. Stay where you're at. Stay there now. Looks like we're a little off beat. Not yet. Thank you for coming. I'm sorry. Here we go. Guys right. Girls left. Here we go. One. <laughs> okay, this one's going to be easy, and it's for all classmates only, though. Who has the most children? Does anybody have ten children? <laughs> Connie, how many you got? Five? Six. Anybody beat six? Henry, you don't. Anybody got six? Six going once. Six going twice. Say it again. John Polhill. Now you didn't think a good looking guy like Johnny Polhill wouldn't put it in action. Did you get the picture, Jennifer? So the last one is he's so fast. <laughs> Uh, we haven't seen each other in 50 years, as we keep saying and reminding ourselves when you look in the mirror. And those of us who are women see their mothers looking back at them. And those of us, those of you who are men, I don't know who you see, but it isn't you anymore. But anyhow, um, what I wanted to know was for all of those people that are working or have worked outside the home, I hate to do this to the homemakers, but anybody that worked outside the home, has anybody worked for the same employer for over 25 years? Hmm. Over 30? Yes. Over 30 years? Over 35 years? No, just in general. Anybody? 35? 34? 34? 30, 34? Here you go, my dear. This is Ed Burns from Goliad, Texas. And I'll tell you, the one thing I didn't expect, because Ed and I are Facebook friends and email friends, so I knew what he looked like, handsome devil, but I didn't expect the Texas accent. But he's got a Texas accent because you went here when? 1967. There you go. That's how you get it. That's it, folks. That's all she wrote. Best of health to everyone. Good night.